I got your costume, Kent. And some other goodies you might like. There she is. Pretty as the posters. The Silver Shroud costume herself. And memorabilia, too? You're something else. Together with my gun, everything's all set. Here you go. After all these years, the Silver Shroud is born again. But there's just one problem. I'm just not Silver Shroud material. I could be Rhett Reinhardt, or, or his butler, Jarvie Blake. But the Shroud is strong, capable. Don't sell yourself short. I got a better idea who should wear it. You up for being a Silver Shroud? You're just like him. Except you probably haven't been in a blimp shot down by mobsters. Why me? No one else would help me find the costume. Even though it sounds crazy, you can't. The whole world's fallen. Fallen hard. We gotta fight to make the place better. So you in? If I go along with this, I could use a little extra. The Shroud's motivated by justice, not caps. Please, you gotta help. Looks like I get to be the Shroud. Yay. The costume and gun are yours. So you patrol good neighbor's streets, and I'll call in any crimes on my radio station. Here's some calling cards, I guess. When you dispatch justice, leave them behind. That way, everyone knows the Silver Shroud has returned. Time to fight crime! presented the facts. Someone else is actually... The master of it all. You're right. But who? Dearest mistress of mysteries, you and I have battled Boston's rogues gallery. Calling all Silver Shroud fans. A once-in-a-lifetime announcement. The Silver Shroud returns and he's gonna clean up the streets. Everyone heard how Wayne Delancey m murdered Miss Selmy and her kid. Over a few lousy caps. Death is coming for you, Wayne. <laughs> Galaxy News Radio. When evil walks the streets of Boston, one man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging the guilty. That guardian is the Silver Shroud. Today's episode, The Mechanist. Unmasked. What's Dangling with the fancy guns? Over a pit of fire. Expensive. Reminds me of our what? adventure against the Chelsea Mingler, a mistress. Indeed, stalwart Shroud. But that malformed murderer was but a moppet compared to the malignancy of the mechanist. Malignant, am I? No, mistress of mystery. But your mistake for evil Your crimes have gone unpunished for too long. What the hell's only wrong with you? I, the well, truly you understand the folly of you human with... cunning. The flesh is weak. Metal is the future of Massachusetts. <laughs> the only future you have is a long nap in a deep hole, mechanist. To me, you're just another two-bit hustler with delusions of grandeur. 
And by the way, you're not fooling anyone with that cheap getup. You're as human as the rest of us. Stalwart Shroud, glance skyward and see. Our newfound friend, the head of the bodiless bot. And it would things. seem he's biting <laughs> through our bindings. Hey down there, mechanist! You robot wannabe! Remember me? No point in leaving that no? for scavengers. I didn't think so. That's the problem. You made me, but you didn't love me. You didn't love any of us, you selfish jump out. Now, it's time. Friend of the show, Jerry, is here. Is this thing on? Hello? Hello? It's on. We're recording in here. Aw, oh, man! Great. Great! The Silver Shroud's dispatched justice already. Miss Selmy has been avenged. Shit, the Shroud off Wayne? Wait, so this guy's actually for real? Oh, you better believe it. So, Jerry, go on. Tell the listeners about what we're talking about. Right. So AJ, you know the chem dealer by Bobby's. He's doing good for himself. Says he's got a whole new market. Kids. Even with his garbage chems, he's just that breaking in the caps. You hear that? No Sounds like the Silver Shroud has another bad show. guy to deal with. Uh, why? This Shroud guy, he's gonna muscle in on the chem trade now? No. He's gonna do something about it. AJ's selling the kids, and his chems have k killed people. And? I don't get it. We can't let AJ kill kids. Whatever. Galaxy! Galaxy! News! Radio! When evil walks the streets of Boston, one man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging the guilty. That guardian is the Silver Shroud. Today's episode, A Slaying in Scully Square. Just uh, down this alley. Well, well, well. Looks like someone got lost on the wrong side of the tracks. <laughs> yeah, wrong side of the tracks. I I'm just meeting a friend. No business of yours. Uh, you perhaps I'll just call him. Now, if, if you'll excuse me. The bombs may have dropped. Not so fast, fancy pants. Your wallet and that snazzy briefcase you're carrying. Hand them over, now. I most certainly will not. Do you have any idea who... Oh, jeez Louise, why'd you go and do that? Because he could have made us, that's why. You want to spend another stretch in the Don't pokey? Be a sap. Now, hey, let's see what's look at in this clown. fancy case. This is my turf, clown. And I don't appreciate what you call them trespasses. Nothing. Papers, no cash, it's worthless. Peddling poison ah. to kids, are we? Today like you face you the Silver Shroud! All right, all right, let's see. <laughs> Who you say? Oh, Christ's sake. Did Kent put you up to this? Oh, man. He keeps moaning about the poor time. little kids. You know who this is? What the hell, right? Tell you what. I'll pay you... What? Let's say 50 the caps just to shut up about it. And, uh, maybe get up Kent off my back. All right? A mystery. Stop sure. selling to children, miscreant. Or face my me. wrath! You better listen. You Throw you. A man in cold the blood. Justice must be served. <laughs> it's the Silver Shroud! Let's get out of here! I ain't afraid of the Silver Shroud. You hear me? Come out and I'll do you like I did the mayor. Come for 
are you, evil doer? And I am a shroud. My work here is done. Or is it? What brought you to Scully Square, Mayor Murphy? A journey that left you dead and Boston leaderless. Why venture? <coughs> Emerge from the shadows, villain, or face the justice of the Silver Shroud! What will become of our stalwart hero? Find out what happens next week. The Silver Shroud's bringing justice to good neighbor. You bad guys better look out. And now, a special update. The villainous assassin Kendra was recently spotted at the third rail. The same Kendra who bombed little Joe Shack and killed four innocent drifters. If you want to see the Silver Shroud in action, stay near Whitechapel Charlie. The Shroud's sure to interrogate him to find the evildoer's whereabouts. Galaxy News Radio. When evil walks the streets of Boston, one man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging the guilty. That guardian is the Silver Shroud. Today's episode, The Mystery of Mayor Murphy. Slowly now, reveal yourself. Silver Shroud. Fret Days not, old oh, friend. You're bad. It's only Can't me. get enough looks of this lovely Mistress figure of mine. Mistress of mystery. Mine. <laughs> what brings you to no Scully Square on mm -hmm. such a foul night? Guess you'll just have to shop. Tracking baby. our dear Mayor Murphy. I'll take a look. Sure. Cash or trade. <laughs> Let's get started. The mayor. So he wasn't here in some kind of official capacity. Hardly. Here, let me show you. The contents of the late mayor's case. But these are real estate papers. Leases and deeds for most of the businesses in Scarlet Square. Indeed they are, my intrepid investigator. It would seem our Mayor Murphy was involved in a rather I've crooked caper. A few caps. He was here to meet with some other mysterious malefactor. So, Mr. Mayor, I hope you found the place all... Silver Shroud, and Mistress of Mystery, and the Mayor. Dead? Fat Fatey, the infamous mob boss. So, you were meeting with Mayor Murphy, but why? Tell me, and you may yet live. Best listen to my friend, Fahey. I'll never talk, and you two are in over your heads. So be it. Death has come for you, evildoer, and I am its shroud. Shroud this, crime fighter. Later, suckers. Silver Shroud, you're shot. Uh, just a graze. You must go after him. No, we'll let our quarry flee for now. That bullet must be removed. And you're bleeding badly. Must get back to my... Hush now, Stoic Shroud. I'll take you to my parlor. It is close, and that wound is worrisome. The parlor? It's been so long. Indeed it has, old friend. Old love. Indeed, it has. And now, we must away. What will become of our stalwart hero? Find out what happens next week on another exciting episode of The Silver Shroud. You've been listening to Galaxy News Radio, a wholly owned subsidiary of Galaxy News Network. Galaxy News Radio. When evil walks the streets of Boston, one man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging the guilty. That guardian is the Silver Shroud. 
today's episode in the parlor of mysteries. Jasmine, chamomile, pain, ecstasy. This can only be the day of mysteries. Still, sweet trout. I removed that scumbag slug, but you're sick with fever and still Beaches. suffering. Make way for pay and cast. Mistress of mysteries, no. Like one of them wankers from the post. All right. What you wearing? Let the man. <coughs> Fat Fatty. You Be look upon the, most the silver friend. shroud. <laughs> I no, seek dear. a miscreant named stumbled. Kendra. The mistress maneuvered. I knew of the Kendra is not one to be trifled with. Days. People associated I with her have a habit of being found face back down back. in a ditch. You'll set on media for a fee. It is not Kendra's wise to stand between the silver shroud and righteous justice. Justice? You mean to end it? In that case, her flat's just it south of good neighbor. Water Street Scarlet Apartments. Look out for the blighters she's got with her. Incurring Nasty the wrath piece of, of business there. Is good an luck. Unfortunate and unexpected annoyance. Unexpected by us, maybe. But perhaps not by Fat Fay. Ah, I'm starting to 